movilizar fuerzas en el extremo sur de la llanura para que los flancos del este y el oeste. Where is Abraham Reyes? Here, amigo. Here. Well, well, well. Look who it is. The American bandit turned bounty hunter who is about to win the Mexico Revolution. I don't know about that, mister. No, but I do, Mr. John Marston. I do. A man like you or me with, with just a few such men, I tell you I could rule the entire country. Hey, hermanos unidos, send my people free. Yeah. Libre Mexico. Mexico. Libre Mexico. It's like food to me. I feel I was sent for them and they were sent to me. Good for you. Uh, when I rule these people, I shall be fair and judicious and wise. How so, do you ask? Very simple. I know these people. I know this land. In, in short, I can make them better. It must be pleasant to be a man so at one with his destiny. Ay, Dios mío, I don't do it for myself, John Marston. I do it for my people. Well, exactly. Sarcasm, my friend, should be beneath a man such as you, don't you think? Very little is beneath a man such as me. Ha! <laughs> okay, well, well, in that case, I assume a little robbery will be a pleasant day's work. All in a good cause, of course. Come, my brother. Let us strike while the iron is hot. Follow me. We must hurry. If it gets me what I want, sure thing, Abraham. Let's go. You must tell me more, John. Are my sources correct? Have you come to Mexico to murder your two best friends? Not exactly. We were friends once. A lot's changed since then. Now that we are friends, I hope you will give me some warning if you get the sudden urge to kill me. You'll be the first to know when I kill you, I promise. So where are they? Who? Williamson and Escuela. I'm not sure exactly where. They are definitely in Mexico. That much I know already. You told me you'd found them. And I will. I have my very best man working on it. If I find out you're lying to me, Reyes, you'll really see the man I used to be. I will give you your friends, I promise. Just give me time. <laughs> so how did you meet uh -oh. these Williams song and Escuella? We ran in the same gang together. Under a fella called Dutch. We were all bad kids. Lost, angry, and forgotten. He kind of saved us. And turned you into criminals? Dutch didn't see us that way. We robbed banks, stole from the rich, and we gave the money to the people who needed it more. So he was a revolutionary too, like me. I suppose. He saw that the system of power was rotten, that good people had been crushed for too long. And he believed that change could only succeed if it was brutal and relentless. Make America what he felt it was supposed to be. I like the sound of this man, Dutch. Another violent idealist. Where is he now? I don't know. But I gotta find him once I'm done with them two. In the end, he went insane. Lost faith in everything. In everyone. You have quite a story, John Marston. I really am a little jealous. Jealous? Of his poetic potential, I mean. He would make an excellent corrido. A bullfight? No, mi hermano. That is a corrida. No, a corrido is as Mexican as Mexico itself. A song, a poem, a story, a ballad. A musical tribute to a heroic man and their great deeds. There are over a hundred written about me. Remind me to stay away from men with guitars. In a country where most people cannot read the newspaper, song is a powerful means of communication. We do what we can to battle the lies and propaganda of the government. I know. I've seen your posters. In the capital, they are already talking about my legendary escape from El Presidio. How I fought off a thousand Mexican soldiers with my bare hands. Finally, the people have the truth. I have to know, <laughs> what did you think of Agustin Allende, Young? I saw enough to know he ain't a good man. He 
It is bad enough he beats the people he's forced to protect, but it is worse that he enjoys it. Something must have made him that way. Cowardice made him that way, my friend. That and Sanchez, of course. Who? General Ignacio Sanchez, our country's kind and generous dictator. Everything comes from him. It is like a father who feeds his son, and then the son takes his dog outside and rapes him. That's a very specific example, Abraham. Es una marioneta. How do you say, a, a, a puppet? Everything he does is controlled by Sanchez. In America? They told us Sanchez was making things better here. Pinche propaganda. He talks about economic reform, about how this is a new golden age for Mexican people. But look around you. The people are poorer than ever. Let's train. Nothing more than a perrito for General Sanchez. A what? A little puppy dog that leaves his feet and makes him feel loved. Oh, watch what you're riding. Not far now. The Parosa is just up ahead. We must hurry. The train will be leaving soon. What's on that train that's so important? I received information that the army is transporting a vast quantity of supplies to distribute to their forces. Do we have a plan? I will explain when we get there. But those supplies won't be arriving. I figured as much. Today, I think they will pay a high price for his treason. It just has to be dark as shit and raining. So listen, this train is filled with valuable supplies we need, but it's also filled with government troops. We'll set up a very loud distraction, you can board the train, and then you can disconnect the army cars, huh? Okay. Okay, but listen, we've got to get this done before the train runs out of the station. You make it sound so easy. <laughs> well, did I not promise you fun times, amigo? Eh? There are too many soldiers. We must surprise them. Here, take this knife. You can use it to kill the guards quietly. Wait until I distract them. Then get on that train as fast as you can, John. Wait here while I create a distraction. So, what's this? Throwing knives? Yeah. Okay then. It's him down. It's him down. Come on. Well, I got him. Get on the train, John. There we go. <laughs> All right, that's him. Come on, him. Throw the knife. Well. That's that, and I can't actually see shit. Like legit, I can't see shit here. A mistake. Thank God for this heavy repeater. Huh? Or is it the Henry repeater? Henry on or something like that?
Just in general, I can't believe that. First of all, the game's really, really like... Is that the one I have to get onto? Just wait, what's going on here? I'll just take out the guards. Yeah, well... There you go. That's... I can't see shit! <laughs> The weather in the game is dynamic, I suppose, so it's just happened to... Oh my god, are you serious? Oh, he's taking a piss, isn't he? Yeah. Alright, I'm going to get a bit closer to the guy up front. I think I can walk over this guy. There we go. <laughs> Talk about horse shit. Yeah, I'll take control of it. Is there anyone else around there? I want to say they're not going to like it very much, John. It's a Gatling gun. Again, if you hear a Gatling gun, don't run straight into it. Okay. No, not get on the train, John. <laughs> Whew. The Euphoria engine, it's a bit, uh... How do I say? A bit too realistic. Especially the way that like you move, you seem to like wobble and get stuck on like corners and stuff like that. You know, ledges. Train. Magnificent! Go ahead and blow the armored car and take whatever you need, my brother. Vámonos. Quick, brother, we don't have much time. On the diamond mine. Like. Come on, my friend. Get that hatch open. Alright, because it's a train robbery. Oh, shit. Now 
Take a look inside. Maybe Agenda has another gift for us. Maybe. Right. Come on, come on, come on. Who to the left? And <laughs> move to the right. pistol is that a new pistol it was probably just a skull field wasn't it yeah it was just a skull field to give to the poor, eh, Mr. Marston? Very noble, I'm sure, but I need to know where Williamson and Escuela are holed up. All in good time, amigo. I'm off to deliver these goods. I'll see you back at the ranch. Oh. My spies tell me they soon will have the information you need. La próxima vez que sea un poco más durito, ¿eh? <laughs> And I mean rougher, ¿eh? <laughs> What would your most loyal follower, Luisa, say about that? Who? Luisa, the girl from Campo Morada. Uh, all right. A gentleman never tells, but she was a most wonderful... Uh, I just say she was increíble. Yes. Let me tell you something. I strongly recommend her. You take her when you have the chance, my brother. <laughs> she thinks she's your wife. My wife? These peasant girls, they believe every word a fellow says. So naive. It's really quite charming. I love peasants. Don't you love peasants? I love them. They have such purity. Are you gonna marry her? Ha! Marry a peasant? My dear boy, don't be absurd. I'm going to be the next president of Mexico. My wife will meet ambassadors, kings, other great men, the very thought that I would marry some peasant girl with a tight gun and the hands of a farmer. Well, I really don't think so. My mother, que Dios la cuide, would turn in her grave. 
Interesting. Mm -hmm. But come on, let's run. I've got an amazing present for you, my brother. I huh? guess the man you seek. Together, we will bring them to justice. Let's go. <laughs> come on, mi hermano. This is the day we have both been waiting for. Is it really? Well, with all that shitload of TNT, it better be. Let's ride. My men will launch a ruse attack on the side entrance to the fort. Meanwhile, you, my American friend, will drive this wagon at the front gate and jump off when you're close. It's been packed with five crates of TNT. That sounds crazy. How long's the fuse? <laughs> yes, like I say, fun times. It's plenty long enough, I think. I see you in there, amigo. Let's go. Okay, go on, shit. Come. You can do this. Oh yeah, I can do it. Well, I did it all right. The explosion was too far from the front gate. Oh, okay, yeah, of course. Of course. <laughs> It's also set at night time, which is great. I love. <sighs> yeah, somehow I don't die from that. Oh, you, you really want me to find a squail in this shit? Okay. I'm gonna die here because I have no cover whatsoever and I don't know where the hell I'm going. Try shooting with your eyes open! I'll try and find where I'm going with my eyes open. What kind of rifles this that I have? Is it the shitty one? It's the shitty one. I don't know why it's went to the shitty one. Oh my god, he can't even aim through the... Go search for him, John, I'll... Uh... God damn you, you son of a bitch. Uh, good to see you. I heard you was coming. You took your time, no? Come on, you're not gonna shoot your own brother, are you? We was family. Yeah, we were. Then you and Dutch went crazy and family didn't mean so much. <laughs> so, now you do the government's work. And what do you do? You just work for a different government. <laughs> Come on, brother. I think we should go our separate ways, huh? What you and Dutch did was wrong, and the way you left me was wrong. 
No, I ain't the judge, but as it turns out, it's you or me. The way I see it, might as well be you. We thought you was dead, brother. I promise. I'm telling the truth. Besides, I can give you Bill. In Dodge, Dodge is in Colombia. I can take you straight to him. Hmm? You left me to die Whoa. to save your own skin, and now <laughs> you expect me to care Whoa, about you? You got it all wrong, brother. I've always loved you. Even now. You won't get me alive, John! I won't with that uh, cattle pistol. Come on, get out the window. Come on, horse. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Had him, then I lost him. Now the fucker's gonna kill me, most probably. There we go, got him, finally, Jesus. Ah, it's with the general. Of course, of course, he's with the general. I ain't here to kill you, Javier. This is just business. You comfortable there? Come on, amigo. Abigail wouldn't want this. Abigail would have killed you already. She always thought you was a creep. Come on. Family, brother. You and me. Like Cain and Abel, I guess. Leaving each other for dead. Yeah. You don't understand what happened. It wasn't like you thought it was. Whatever you say, old friend. Yeah. It was Bill, not me. Yeah, and he's next. You're gonna be locked up for a hell of a long time. Unless they choose to hang you. Put him in the cell for now, John. Oh, okay. Oh my god, come here. So you and Bill are back together. Two crazy men sharing a bed. Go to hell! Pathetic fool! Oh, you shit. Don't be sure about what you're doing, brother. You saw me out! Didn't that life we had mean nothing to you? Oh! Ah, oh, you puto! Oh! One day, one day I promise you, you're gonna regret this. One day's about all you got left. Oh. I hope you and your wife and children rot in hell. You know that life we lived is over. And when we was living it, it didn't mean nothing anyway. It was just an excuse, and we all knew. What I knew is that you was always a puto. And you're still a puto! Marston, come with me. The army sent reinforcements. Come. Yeah, go with your puto. <laughs> the army is Ora coming. Aquí. Get up there and man that cannon. Man the cannon now. Okay. I will if I can get around the fucking. Oh, just go through here, huh? Hey, what would you know, a cannon? Stop 
cannon. And I can't see shit. Not exaggerating, I really can't see shit all. Luckily, there's like a wide range of damage. Get a squaler. If we can get through the doors. <laughs> oh, sorry, dude. Go out of my way. Mr. Marston, fancy seeing you down here. I must say it's a pleasant surprise to see you. You've done well, Mr. Marston. Now, Javier here gets to see how far the hand of justice can reach. Come on, you. Get in the damn automobile. Can we assume one of my commitments is cleared? Unfortunately, nothing is cleared, John, until your obligations are met. We need you to find Williamson, then head to Blackwater as quick as you can. We have reason to believe that Dutch Vanderland is in the area. Oh, your wife sends her regards. Unless you want this town to tear you and your boys to shreds, I suggest you let him go. And you think you could tell me what to do, friend? Oh, you should listen to him, friend. Look at that. You want to risk it? <laughs> the American is a drunk. If I were you, I would, I would pull that trigger. <laughs> Put the gun down, Americano. Ya, ya, mátalo. Dejen mi hombre. Mierda! Huh? Ay, Dios, Dios mío. Santa Maria! So you want to settle this now, friend? Or you want me to shoot you in the head right now for that poor girl? Okay, but we fight like men, not like 
Dogs. <sighs> Uh, Abram has a great line about Louisa, by the way. He's such a sleazy man. I love him. Thanks, my brother. Oh, Louisa. Now the people are finally ready. Today we overthrow the coronel. Senor. There are prisoners in jail who will fight on our side. Can you save them? I will rally the peasants, Jump. You go after the prisoners. Okay. Yeah, locks. Yo, my friends. Reyes is getting ready to attack Linde's mansion. Oh. I, I would shoot it if I could bloody see it. Unbelievable. I can't actually see where the fucking. There is. Can't believe that shit. <laughs> oh, hey. Oh, yeah, like this repeater is like the best. Uh... I kind of like the um, heavy bolt rifle. We're going to save that for the uh, right in the end. I think that guy had a sniper rifle. <sighs> Pop out again. I thought he was already dead. What was that? What was that dead eye against there? Uh... Go for the machine gun, John. We will blast through the door with gunpowder barrels. Wait while we get everything into position. <sighs> now, John. Again, don't run out if there's a Gatling gun.
oigan, hachas. Echen la puerta abajo. ¿Qué me miras? ¿Es bien, cabrón? <risa> oh, compadres, aquí vienen más. Están subiendo la cuesta. Defende que hay. Debo pillar. No brigues tú. I dare say not very much. What the fuck, dude? There we go. I guess it's like snipers will just destroy you. Oh well you can't jump over that obviously. I really prefer my own horse, but we don't have time. Come on, come on. Yeah. Again, that guy. Got him now. What the hell are you doing? Find my freedom, pendejo. Now shut up, you dumb ape, and get out of the wagon. Apurate. I'm coming out. Don't shoot. Here, take Williamson. Just let me live. I will leave the country. I promise. You always was weak-minded. You're the one who let Dutch drive you insane! Dutch wanted you dead! A la mierda! You really want to die, friend? Allende is dead! Mexico is mine! My people are free, and it is all thanks to you, Joe. And to the people who laid down their lives. People like Luisa. Oh, yes. She, she was very brave, and she will be missed. Who was she again? Your peasant girl wife-to-be? Oh, yes, of course. She, she will have a day named after her. Laura's day! Luisa. What? Oh, yes, I, I knew Laura as well. Magnificent girl, like riding a pompous bull it was, amigo. You never saw anything like it. Anyway, enough about sport. Let's get back to politics. I trust you will join us in riding on the capital. I'd love to, but with Williamson dead, my jailers need me back in Blackwater. Hey, que hacen? Levantense. Well, I must say, I'll miss you, John Marston. I doubt you'll even remember me, Abraham, but it's been an experience. Good luck with the revolution. If you win power, remember why you wanted it. Mm. Well, 
Chao, safely, amigo. Vamos. <laughs> and one end to uh, the general and Bill Abraham. Anyways, off to Blackwater next. <laughs>